Hello, guys. Okay, chat works, camera doesn't work. Let me figure that out. Okay, just a second here. There we got that. Now we have the camera working. So how's everybody doing? As you can see, this will be a solo session. Aki is still having issues with his shifts, but by September that should change. So, you'll probably see us both back relatively soon. So, uh, sorry guys, I'm chatting with a friend that needs some support in the parallel who just started writing to me, so I'll do that probably a little bit in parallel and look over to that screen every now and then. Um, yeah, what we'll do is take care of some of my cargo plans, since I'm way behind Aki in uh, doing stuff, since... There's way less cities than industries, so all that is a little easier to do. So we have a couple of things that I want to start just to uh, enable me to catch up with him a little bit. And eventually, once he has everything connected up, we'll probably start sharing uh, work a little bit. There we go. Um, what, I was, what was I saying? Yeah, I'm going to start doing some projects with the cargo and once uh, Aki is done connecting everything up, which he's already starting on this island, so basically on this... Has he everything connected up already here? Let me see. Yeah, for the most part, I believe. Might make a little branch line here. I think he's already planning some stuff here still. Uh, I think he needs to connect that still up. Otherwise, most of it is already done, I think. So once he's finished with that, he'll probably help me out a little bit. And we'll see how that goes. But for now... Actually... Close that up again. There we go. Until then, we'll uh, just try to get some stuff going. So let's unpause the game. Um, and don't worry, guys. I cleared this with him first. I won't play without him without asking him first. That's our game. Uh, in terms of me, myself, starting any game again. Uh, not anytime soon, since I started the job again. Uh, which is going good, by the way, in case anybody's wondering. First paycheck arrived, so everything's good. Um, I'm able to put my expertise to good use in the company, so I'm pretty happy about that. But that also means I have less time. 
I also want to put a little bit more work in uh, getting a little bit of a social life again, so I'll have to figure that out, how much time I have for stuff. Doing more live streaming uh, already takes a load off me in terms of having to do a lot of video editing, so that's already great. Since it's already uploaded to YouTube, I don't need the upload time, I don't need the rendering time, all that. And OBS is doing a pretty good job. Hi, Pat McPat. How are you doing? Who else is in the chat? Guys, say hello so I know who's there. Um, so you can see I was planning to deliver a little bit more oil to my oil refinery since there's not a whole lot going on there right now. I'm not sure whether I'm going to need to uh, expand this a little bit. Are these both waiting for stuff? They actually are. Do I have this programmed? Okay, I'll let two of them in for refined products and just one for oil. Uh, yeah, that should be okay for now. We can add another platform, I believe. Yeah, we need to do a little bit of retracking, but that should be possible to add another one if necessary. But let's see whether it is actually necessary. So let's uh, let's start up here. Um, Probably gonna br make a bridge over this thing. For which I probably need to do that. No, I didn't need to do that. Uh, I need to do this, however, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, that doesn't work. But this should now. Oh, I don't need electrified. What am I doing? Um, branch line. I'm thinking is more about where I'm gonna put a depot for these guys.
Still like these ones the best. some room for some signals or should we actually eh. maybe not uh, let's make this go in this direction station there Probably the Russian ones, where we don't have the characters in the font. Hi Milkshake, uh, McPat, yeah, back in OpenTTD. The problem was uh, mostly with uh, Daily Aki's, um, yeah, with his problems with the shifts. It's not that we didn't want to do it or that I didn't feel like playing, uh, it was simply we couldn't Simply we couldn't do it because we couldn't find a time to do it. Sorry, as I said, I sometimes have to take care of a friend. Okay, let's see here. Basically the same. We can take the depot back there to do this as well and let's put a station here um, if you don't like to set up with the me just dragging these tanks there don't worry about it uh, probably um, do something with it eventually so they always arrive from the back, so... Yeah... Let's put maybe one signal there... And then let's see how we can hook this up. So we're gonna tunnel through here. to fix that tile. Let me actually do that right away. Let's see, where did we add that stuff? What was that? Anybody have any idea where that was?
Yeah, that was them. Alright, so let's drag that all the way back there. And if we do like this. Asphalt road, right? Yeah. And then we need a crossover here. And then that signal needs to be there. And then we need one signal there. Okay. Um, do we need that two track? Probably enough if you do this. Yeah, let's try it out. We'll see whether it works. How long is that? Yeah, more than enough. Okay. So, we have the connection here. Can they get from here to the refinery? They should be able to, right? Go all the way through here, and blah, blah, blah. And then... can get there from the other side okay so we need a little bit more of a complex junction here shouldn't be a big problem though that should be enough for now get out and then they go all the way over there and then they can't get back so let's give them a way to get back
Okay, that way they can get back, and this way they can get in. Don't necessarily like that uh, arrangement here, but... Hi, Balloonie. But that should be good enough for now. So, let's see. All the same type, right? Yeah. There we go. Just waiting for them to load, so just so I see that it actually works. But the coverage should be fine. Yeah, we have more than enough fishing grounds anyway. So, okay, that is loading, that is loading, good. Then... Next one... Next ones are down there. Just checking again from this direction. If we send them there, through the town, there. Okay, they can get off here and they can get back there. So we can theoretically, we could use these depots. Yeah, we could use those depots. Let's just make two platforms so two trains can wait there. Uh, 
And let's hook it up there. By the way, what were those stations called? Wait, why isn't it called oil welds? Is one of his stations station called oil welds? Of course it is. For these, we'll probably do a little bit of a separate thing. Yeah, we'll probably stay on this level. And we'll probably make that actually Double track. That signal on this track? Yeah. Mm. I might put more industry, I might connect more industry with this. Okay, so this one's pretty simple.
Eh, actually, should be fine. Actually, I'm probably not going to deliver anything here anytime soon, so I don't need that. And we probably... Mm, let's send two trains there, I think. Yeah, that's not true there for now. Um, that means we we actually if we want to do that, we need a little bit of a junction here. should be fine. Sorry, my hand is falling asleep a little. I might actually take one of these um, bandages off that I'm currently wearing. Because one of them is restricting my blood flow a little.
Sure, why not? Um, I'm not actually sure whether... Feels a little bit more natural. Um, we'll decorate that later. Is that called woods? Hmm. There. I'm not sure what we'll do with the glass and whether we'll actually keep producing glass here, but hey, why not? Oh wow, there's a lot of stuff we haven't grouped here. Oh wow, this is the first coal that we deliver by truck, that's interesting. Guess you're wondering why I'm changing this. That's because ECS was so brilliant to use GD twice, once for goods and once for gold. So we need to distinguish that. Um, yeah, that should be a subsidy. Theoretically, we also could pick up some coal here also and deliver it there. I think we have some leftover here. Um, okay, but other than that, I think that should be the oil. Have the trains arrived yet? No. Where are they? Oh, there's one. It's the second. And the third. And a fourth, and a fifth, and a sixth. That should be them. Yeah, that guy's going in another direction. So, yeah, send more oil. That is done. That's one thing done.
I think these guys are so far apart that I don't think we'll need... That's an oil train. Don't I have a tooltip for a train? No? Ah, uh, not really. Yeah, these should be far enough apart that uh, we don't really need a second delivery platform. At least I hope so. Find products are waiting. And the initial um, level of how much oil you can deliver to an oil refinery is pretty damn high, so that shouldn't be an issue. Okay, what else? Wood. Oh, yeah, right. Also, just one delivering platform, but, uh, well. Okay. Also from up there. It's good that we already have the cargo lines separate. Although... Yeah, we can split that off. Um, getting that there. If they can get... How do I get in there from that direction? my favorite thing to do here, but... But it should work. Except this is crap, because there could be trains waiting here. Yeah, yeah I think I should bridge this. Can't really, really tunnel. No, oh, we actually can. Hmm. Uh, 
Yeah, let's do it like that, maybe. Instead. Yeah, that's maybe better. Not ideal, but I think it's good enough. So that way they get in, and then they need to get out. And to get out, they basically just need this connection. No, wait, that's an entrance. Wait, no, this doesn't work. This is an entrance. That doesn't work. So coming from the south, they can get in here via this. But from the north...
There we go. Okay, that way they get in. How do we get uh, get them out again? Not pretty, but it should work. So let's see. Hi, Martin Miguel Gomez Salvi. That's the name. How are you doing, my friend?
should be able to use that depot. Do we have wood drains already? I'm sure we do, right? Yeah, we do. Only one though. Not a big distance, so let's him let's leave him running alone, and we haven't actually set the other stations up yet. So you, my friend, can still vanish. Uh, you can run though. Okay, where? Oh man, those are far away. Hmm. But we can hook those up maybe here. That one. Hmm. A little close, so we probably want to do this like that. Boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It's a long way. But we need to get here eventually anyway because of the aluminum plant, so... Hey Scotty, how are you doing my friend? Did everybody have a good weekend?
Can they actually get there from here? I don't think so. See, that's why I put that in. <laughs> that feature. That would have been bad. Uh... I'm gonna cause so many traffic jams here. Here I'm thinking now, should I hook that up directly to here or should I go here? I'm actually thinking I'm gonna hook it up there. Let me see here.
Okay. Hey. 
And now you're chilling with me. Well, that's great. Hope you're enjoying yourself. Sorry that I'm a little quiet when I have to think about what I'm doing. I need to concentrate a little bit. Let me actually take this thing off. Okay, now we need to send trains there. So, one we can use this depot for. Then those guys will all go through here. So they can use this depot, I think. Yeah, they should be able to.
Uh, Scotty, I haven't actually checked that out. And let me put it this way. Um, playing any new games will not be on the agenda anytime soon because I just don't have the time. I still want to finish the Witcher um, lore series, then I want to finish The Witcher 3 with all the DLC that I still have to play. After that, I want to play Witcher 1, Witcher 2, and then Witcher 3 again with a different mod. Uh, I want to play Open TTD. I want to play Panzer Corps with Brakada and uh, do every couple of weeks the history stuff with him, the corporation stream. So, and I do the stream with Wing Commander Saga. I am um, just now that I'm working, that's just gonna be it. Um, and yeah, playing two games, and one is basically the same with modern graphics. It's ugh. I'm not such a graphic whore that I need that, so I basically have the same game all over again. Just I have to learn it again, how to do stuff effectively and stuff, and yeah. I might eventually give it a try, but not while this stream is still going on. Maybe once we're finished with this map. It's also a thing that I kind of am a little bit more into cooperative stuff these days with games like this so i don't know if if train fever had a cooperative multiplayer mode i totally plan to do something with Dailyaki at some point but unfortunately it doesn't so hmm not sure by the way, sorry that I'm looking to the side when I'm talking to you. I should probably look into the camera, but I'm kind of looking at your message on the chat. Um, so, yeah, I I get it that people might want to see that, but I don't see it happening anytime soon. I have so much stuff that I still want to do and still am doing at the moment. I'm not I'm not seeing it happening. Also, it wasn't just the GUI settings that pissed me off. I also didn't like the initial performance stuff in that game. Just took too way too long. Game froze every couple of seconds. It's just not how you do things these days. But yeah, I, I might again give it another try at some point, but it's not gonna happen this year. Maybe next year, who knows. But uh, not in this year. I'm also wasting some time these days on re-watching a certain stream and doing um, a kill board and a quest log for them. I'm watching a couple of guys, uh, YouTube reactors, play a D&D &D game. And uh, I kind of volunteered myself to make a... Uh, to make a um, quest log and kill board for them, for the characters. So I'm kind of working on that. Which means I'm not so much working on the quest log on the killboard that's pretty easy it's just a wiki that i need to update uh it's more the re-watching these uh, the sessions by the way and if anybody is even remotely interested in that uh the channel is called geek house so g-e-e-k and then house just house well you probably also know how to spell geek if you're on my channel so geek house and the series is called Reactors and Realms. I can only say I highly recommend you ch at least check that out. Uh, the first couple of sessions are a little slow because nearly all of the players, except for one, uh, the girlfriend of the DM, of the Dungeon Master, 
uh, are complete noobs in the first session to D&D. They never play had played it, but later on they really get into their characters. The DM is absolutely fantastic. The players are all great. Uh, early on they also have a little technical issues where um, the DM and his girlfriend sometimes cut out and have some internet issues, but they resolve that about after the first uh, four or five sessions also and it's just absolutely amazing there's drama in it there's really great stuff happening there so and they just completed their first season at 30 episodes and they're now taking a little bit of a break um and they will start at the end of september with uh, the second season so if you want to bench the first season to catch up, now is the time to do it. I can only recommend that. I usually don't watch people play online D&D because even if there's professional dungeon masters and stuff, usually it just doesn't work for me. But this series is absolutely fantastic. If there is going to be a Transport Fever 2 or Train Fever 2 or whatever they're going to call it, uh, I probably am going to wait for that one and buy that one because Transport Fever was already kind of Train Fever 2.0 since, yeah, it was basically the same game with a couple features more. Grr. Selling that again for full price is already a little bit iffy. So Train Fever 2 will probably be exactly the same. Um, What? Did I not refit you guys? No, I did. Wait, what? Seriously? Ah. Uh. Are you kidding me? That's what I hate about ECS, that if you're not close enough, sometimes the building that you're covering doesn't actually accept the cargo. Yeah, we actually need to be on the other side for it to be accepted. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, that's annoying. Now we built all this crap for absolutely nothing. That's so annoying. I really wanted the subsidy for a change. Not that we need it, but would have been nice because I've been kind of subsidy hunting for a little while. I always forget to do them. That's a shame. Oh well. Crap happens, I guess. Okay, where, where are we at the time? So... I'm approaching two hours, so let's see what else we can do. Because I'm not going to make it too long. Um, I just want to get wanted to get some of this stuff done. I still want to have some left when I start... Uh, playing with Aki again. Oh, crap. Are those all boxed mines? Are you kidding me? Holy crap. Okay, we already have a line here. I also don't want to overstrain my hand. I currently, in case you haven't seen that, I currently have a uh, tendon inflammation in my hand. I guess that's how you say it in English. Tendonitis or something like that. So, uh, and obviously I need that hand for our mouse work every day at work now, so. 
I shouldn't uh, play too many games that ha that basically consist of me clicking around a whole lot. So I'm not going to do f a four hour stream today. I need to uh, restrain myself a little in that area. Hmm. Okay, now that I have that cargo line over here. Could probably bring that all the way over here because I kind of wanted to get to this side of Hitchens, Hitchin or Hitchens, Hitchin. Uh, anyway, because I wanted to deliver some stuff to this factory. Um, since I'm gonna produce steel at the end of this line, I might as well come back with it but there's a mountain here which is already a little Ooh, yeah and I'm tired guys um, and hmm it will be a tricky line to build Tricky line to build. There's another mine here. Jeez. Mm. Probably need to stay on this level for a while because that's where the factory is. Jesus. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that right now. Hmm. What was that? No, that's all stuff down there. I don't want to do that. Yeah, it's all going down there. <laughs> a little messed up how do I not a whole lot of room here how busy is this passenger line not very I think yeah we could build it like this and just have the trains back up into it then again where does this come from? There and there and there and there and there. Oh, jeez. So we could come from that direction. That would mean we come from this and there we already kind hmm. okay if we make this section fully double track then we have kind of a cargo connection but not really where I need it <sighs> Oh man, my brain isn't working. Yeah. Anyway, then th then the plan is to deliver this steel to all the all these factories and uh, vehicle plants. Yeah, especially to Patsy. It's kind of the idea. Hmm. 
Hmm. Anybody have any ideas what I should do next? This is the most, most crazy one. Jesus, how do I get to all this stuff? Okay, this is accessible from this. Yeah, that's accessible there. That is more or less accessible from I don't know where, but we can hook that up here somewhere. These two, hmm. How do I do these two? Hmm. Let's see here. Oh, where the fuck did we come out? Over there, okay. This is such horrible terrain.
What am I doing? It's all S curves, so that doesn't really have any speed impact. really mountainous crap but not really a way around it eh. we need to get up that mountain one way or another These they should for the most part Yeah, they should actually go empty up and uh, full down so Should be fine
And then there's the question, where do we actually put this station? No, we don't need that with our... Not that kind of station... This could quickly completely overload.
Hmm, Junkers U252, nice. Okay, why not? Let's make sure this time this actually accepts the cargo, but this what heliport what the fuck are you talking about oh that thing now I don't want to connect it to that put it on the other side uh, wait where did it need to go just to the town? Oh, just to the town. Interesting. Uh, in that case... And in case you're wondering, ah, oh, this thing doesn't, uh, you're not delivering anything, anything to this yet. Yeah, there's a minimum of uh, cargo that you can get out of an industry, even if you don't put anything in. So it should be fine. Won't get a lot out out of it, but you can get some. Put five vehicles on it. Oh, this actually has a trailer? That's interesting. Wait, what? Yeah, it's actually pretty fast. Okay. Go. Yeah, they all have a trailer. Nice. See? There's some food arriving. 
anyone loaded up with anything yet. Nope. But we'll get a message about it. So the food is getting there and this thing accepts food, right? Yeah, okay. So we should be fine for that one. Okay, what else were we doing? Okay, we had this set up. Oh, jeez. How do we get that one? It's even higher up. Well, train will go up empty, so I guess it will be fine. I hope. Let's just send one train to this thing. This is a little high up. Oh, well, you know what? Whatever. Nah, let's just send one. This is a crazy place. Okay, where else? This one, this one, this one, that one. Okay, these two. There we go, at least you have the subsidy. Uh, this was... Yeah, this had the ability to go around. Okay, so that's that hooked up. this one. Okay. Probably go around the town.
that should work. How do we get there? If you follow this line... Maybe we can branch off here... Why is this built like that? Well, I won't question it. That was Arcus build. I'm not gonna change this track layout. So now we should be able to reach this. Go all the way there. Oh wait, we need to go down there. Now we're gonna stay on the main track. And so I need to reach those two guys. For this guy there isn't isn't even room here.
GRF names uh, should be in the video description. Rai Rai Yarshi. If it's not a list, it's uh, a zip file in which they all included. Hi Gravity Shadow, how are you doing? Sorry guys that I'm not talking a whole lot, I'm actually pretty tired and trying to concentrate which is already pretty hard since I'm tired. Okay, have we got everything? I think we have everything. Okay, so let's put the stations in place. And once we have all those stations in place, we should be good. That's probably the last thing I'll do today, because I'm really getting tired. And I don't want to mess everything up. The last thing I want is when I start back with Aki, 
Doing a lot of lost trains because I messed things up. Ah, there's another one I missed. Actually, we're gonna leave that one. Because I have no idea how to connect it up. It's in such an awkward position. so much box that I don't even know how that station can handle that. Okay, that should be everything on this side, right? I think so. Okay, then these two. Okay, somebody notices something I'm missing, please let me know. I think I didn't miss anything. Wait a second, that goes up here again. Now, if we prolong this, we might as well prolong it the entire way. There we go. This one we actually don't need. There we go. But we'll add that just so this, just so trees can grow there. Um, and this is a long trip. This is a long ass trip. Okay, now depots. Hmm, kind of need a depot here, I guess. <laughs> kind of before they come out, they should have a depot where they can get in again. to come from this direction so I guess it's enough if I put one here
not sure that's the most effective locomotive anymore. Let's build that anew. Let's actually use a German. This has pretty good tractive effort, so... 85, I think that is actually a cargo locomotive. Uh, let me quickly look that up, actually. Cargo locomotive. Dedicated cargo locomotive. Well, oh, Blumentritt, do you see all these new GRFs on this game? Wow, and I thought I used much. Nice live stream, by the way. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we uh, even added a code change so we could actually use this many in multiplayer because usually I play this with someone. So, yeah, we're using quite a few. Let me actually see whether this thing can pull that all on its own. Yeah, it can. Nice. Okay. Okay, where do we start? Let's start down there. That's down there. Let's start over there.
then this one where we'll only send one and then that should be it I think let's see mistakes and accidentally copied any orders nope all different ones all groups just have two trains except for that one with one so where are those steel trains go oh no those are wood trains okay yeah, those will have to wait now a little bit. Uh, oh shit, this part is not signaled. Okay. I may actually save this just to make sure. Lots of trains leaving that depot. trains recently no just some stuff getting old we know about that yeah nothing get, nothing getting lost it's a good sign so again um I'm suspecting in September we will we'll be able to stream together then me and Aki um, he's taking another position at the company, I think, which should free up some time. He'll talk about it next time. So, hopefully next time we can do cooperative, cooperative gameplay again. No idea how to hook that steel station up, which I kind of wanted to do also, but... I have no idea how. Could deliver everything here and then just transport by truck over here but that would be silly so i don't know i really don't know so so much so little space here i'll discuss it with aki but maybe this will be good enough just aluminum who knows how many are still in there uh, quite a few Yeah. Hmm. Even has decent acceleration. Well, it's when it's empty, but still. going in that direction where might you go ah he's probably going to that one
these are doing at least 80. I think some of these passenger trains, eh, they can actually go a little faster. Well, being stuck behind an 80 kilometer per hour train is probably not that bad. Why is this bridge not signaled? VR85 was actually the German locomotive I was looking forward to because, yeah, that's a pretty damn good cargo locomotive. And the last one. Which is good since we have a little bit of a traffic jam here. That'll fix itself though. Once all these guys are gone, okay, these, goes, these go in this direction. Now the wood trains can follow. Why aren't they actually following? Oh, wait. They don't have a path signal. That makes sense. Well, for now it didn't matter. That way they left all the coal trains out. stuff yeah we added quite a few things here and this line is insane Got quite a few things done already. Aki is almost done hooking everything up. Interesting, interesting. Man, look at that traffic in this area. Yeah, that's industrial area. There's a whole lot of going on there. There's no oil delivery trains waiting though, so that's good. So the one platform for delivery should be still good enough. How much? Uh, not actually that much. In terms of refined products waiting, how big are you? Where does it show the total cargo again? Oh, there we go. 412 liters. Wait, what? Is that what it has currently and this is what it can have? Um, in that case, yeah, this would still fit in one train. So once the next one arrives, yeah, no problem yet. Let me actually check out the history of that station. Uh, pretty constant. Kind of makes a zigzag. Goes up a little bit by tendency, but not bad yet. That's good enough. Well, 
Wood products pretty much the same. Another wood train arriving. Here we also don't have any blockages, so... This back and forth over these crossovers doesn't seem to happen very often, so that's good. Two wood trains arriving. They only have one delivery platform, but that also doesn't seem to be a major problem. It's maybe a problem that this guy has to wait on this crossover, but... Shouldn't be a major issue. At least I don't think so. Oh yes, we got Telex. Nice. So that's something I'm gonna do. We actually have a template for those? No. In that case... Well, we can actually do that differently. Double the speed, double the capacity. That's great. So that is now Traffic is still, for the most part, going smoothly in this area. So I'm pretty happy with that. Let's make another signal here, just so that's more smoothly. Actually, let, let's put a signal on the bridge. Should be fine. Whether it's gonna wait on the line or on the bridge doesn't really make a difference. There's a little bit of a hold up here. You might add another platform here and maybe here if you can get that hmm, if you can get that squeezed in there. I think we do. But for now it's for now this is fine. We might add one, add another one here. Yeah, there's starting to be a little bit of an issue. I have to wait a little bit. And there's a whole lot of stuff incoming. So. Everything else seems to be fine, though. How's the box it going? That's wood. Slowly loading up. Yeah, that, that'll take a while. That will take a while. But they apparently all reached their target. This one hasn't yet. Where is it? Still on the way somewhere. Probably somewhere on this line. Let's check.
Oh jeez. That race just making its way up the loop. And that way, and that guy's only here, yeah. Yeah, they're slowly making their way up there. Probably add more trains to that line eventually. But they're on the right place. And yes, Ulrich Blumentritt, we don't just have a lot, we also use it all. Absolutely, we do. We probably haven't used every single one yet, but we intend to. Let me actually check. We definitely use that, 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 yeah. Uh, we did the yeah, that, 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 that. Those we do use that one, that one, that one, that one. Pipe. I don't know. Have we have we built a pipeline yet? I don't know. Most of the stations where you wanna use eventually new objects. There's 75% of those you probably have used. Industry set, obviously. All the vehicle sets. Vacuum trains, of course, not yet. Neither are a maglev, because we don't have those yet. Neither the U-Bahn set, but those we will use eventually. Road vehicle, same thing. What's available, we already use. We already have the first ferry that we're using. Hot air balloon, we don't have yet. Uh, air, we're doing something with already... Yeah, we're pretty much using everything. What we're not yet using, we're gonna use. Lots of oil arriving here already. We need to start transporting off some stuff that we are producing here. Man, there's so much industry on this map. This will be a mammoth project, hooking this all up. The next thing that we'll do is hook up uh, the coal that the aluminum plant, of course, needs. That'll be this. Now at least we already have the line mostly in place. So this, 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 and this. Well, this one, I'm not so sure. This one we might actually hook up to... I have no idea how we'll even get to that thing. Jesus Christ, it's all the way on top of the mountain. We might actually use trucks to get that a little lower. Um, but these three, we should be able to hook up. Let me see. Yeah, that shouldn't be a problem. We should be able to hook those up here. Uh, this one we can also hook up here. We just need to go through that valley. Um, yeah, that's all on that side. These two, yeah, are basically already next to lines. This one, yeah, we'll probably transport by truck down here somewhere and make a station here. That one we're already grabbing. We just need to... Where is that actually going? Is that already going there? No, that's going to the... That was a glass something. It, yeah. So we'll also send some of that there. But yeah, that shouldn't be a problem now that we have the line in place. Uh, iron ore, I kind of want it also to send to the steel mill here. Not sure when I'm going to do that. Uh, and then we'll send the steel off, of course, to all the factories and to two major uh, vehicle plants. One there for that part of the continent and one there for that part of the continent. And then eventually we deliver vehicles from there all over the place. Yeah, it's a pretty nice setup. We also upload the save game, so if you load one of those, um, 
you already have the parameters in there because the zips of course don't tell you what exactly we put in the parameters here um also we use road types those only work with my version of the game and a separate fork but no other official version kind of so you probably want to use my version of the game which you can also find in the video description um and then you the best thing you can do is just load a save game save the preset as whatever you want and then you can start a new game with that preset which already has the uh, parameters also set up what would it update marika oh yeah i don't want to update that because the new version has a bug The new version kind of messed up a uh, couple of sprites. So don't use the newest version of Mariko. That kind of messed up... Yeah, these things. These tiles. Where you have the road and it goes into the T section. T uh, crossing here. That, that tile is broken in the newest version. And he hasn't fixed it yet for months. So... No idea when that's gonna happen, so be wary of that. Go for version... which one is this that we're using? We're using version 033. So use that one. The 034, I think that's the newer one that is broken. Use faster gold trains. Okay, I'm gonna do that next time. So I'm probably gonna call it quits. Uh, at this point guys, it's getting late, need to work tomorrow again, so um, we got some stuff done, some major track work done to actually reach all this crap, so the rest should be easier from now on. Uh, I had to build a lot of track my own, I just couldn't use any passenger lines, which is probably better. I don't want to put so much cargo on, hit on Aki's passenger lines anyway, so... Um, I mean, I put a lot of this one, but this one is not yet very busy, so that should be fine. And once we build any high-speed trains, we're probably going to build separate tracks for those anyway. So, should be good. We got a lot of stuff done. We got a lot of stuff sent to our industries. Lots more oil, lots more wood. So, in terms of wood products, uh, production, and in terms of refined products and potentially also petrol yeah which we don't currently transport anywhere we should be good for a while we should probably need two additional platforms here uh, one more delivery platform and then probably another platform for petrol but uh, otherwise we should be good for a while here we uh, the layout is already in a place where we can easily add new platforms so that should be good for a while. I don't know whether this... Uh... <sighs> oh, jeez, excuse me. Um, whether this layout is fine in terms of how the junctions work here, but for now it seems to be working. There's not a whole lot yet going on that year. Once we get the steel trains and the coal trains in here, we'll have to look into that. But for now, let me save this here. And uh, yeah. I don't know when you can expect us back. I'll stay in touch with Aki and let you know uh, when we'll be able to do the cooperative gameplay again. But for now, I think this is good enough. There's another forest that doesn't really have any trees around it. Let me fix that real quick. I hate that. Forest industry with no forest around it. There we go. So. Let me save... Oh, why not? Why not right here? So let me save this and say, yeah. As always, keep your heads down, folks. I'll see you on the next one.